A former Boy Scout says he was molested and is now suing the Boy Scouts of America. The man, now in his 40s, says it happened at a camp near Cloudcroft in the 1980s. News 13's So Young Kim joins us with more. Kim, the lawsuit alleges Mike Kessler, who is now dead, ran a troop in Abilene, Texas, abused and molested the 13-year-old scout for several years and attempted to have sex with the boy during a 1982 trip to Camp Dale Resler near Cloudcroft. The attorney for the plaintiff, just listed as John Doe, says the abuse continued once they got back to Abilene. The lawsuit states Kessler's role was to educate and mentor. The plaintiff stating Kessler was like a father figure to him. The suit claims the Boy Scouts of America should have instructed the scoutmaster not to sleep in boys' tents that were not related to him, which put scouts like the plaintiff at a risk of being assaulted. Our client um, has had a hard life. He's had a very hard life, and it, it all started, you know, very close in time to, to the time of his abuse. I believe he, you know, his grades declined. He started drinking heavily in order to sort of quiet the shame in the back of his mind at a very young age. Levi Monagle says abuse at this young age is devastating for a child, and they carry it with them their whole lives. The plaintiff says he has suffered emotional distress and years of paying for counseling and psychiatric treatment. Monagle says the Boy Scouts of America took too long to put in regulations, restricting access of scout leaders on these types of trips. Kim, back to you. Okay, thank you so young. Now, Boy Scouts of America sent a statement saying it could not comment on the lawsuit, but they stated that nothing is more important than the safety of our kids and allegations contained in the suit run against everything the organization stands for.